Already thinking about dinner plans, but not sure what to make in today's Chef's Kitchen, Central Florida Demand's Allison Walker joins us from Virgin Olive Market in Orlando with a new twist and an old favorite. And it's one you can make right in the comfort of your very own home. So when you think of meatloaf, you're probably not thinking about a sandwich or turkey or oats for that matter. Well, here at Virgin Olive Market, you're about to find out how to make a brand new menu item called the Grateful Loafer. Did you uh, make the name up or uh, did your wife do that? We split that duty. <laughs> Robert Harris and his wife are revealing their newest creation, a turkey meatloaf sandwich. The herbs of Provence with uh, garlic, uh, uh, onion, a little bit of sage, uh, a couple of things we can't tell you about. Oh, come on, come um, on. It's just, it's just me and you. Come all on. right, salt and pepper. The basics, man, the basics. All right, all right. You'll also need sweet potatoes, zucchini, squash, mushrooms, raw celery, a mixture of cheeses, and eggs. And the cool part here, I was making it with breadcrumbs. Yep. She makes it with oats. That's awesome. So that makes it gluten-free. Then just toss it all into a big old bowl. Robert, I could bathe in this. I could just jump in this right well, now. I can get a bigger bowl. <laughs> That'll be next week's episode. <laughs> Do it the old-fashioned way. Just get your hands in there. And the other thing that I learned was that you're supposed to put like, like a divot in the middle so because it, it'll rise a little bit. Once it bakes at 400 degrees for 50 minutes, start stacking your sandwich and drizzle on sweet chili aioli. Oh, come on, while we're at it, it can't hurt if you dunk each bite into a side of mushroom gravy. Wonderful things to happen in my mouth. That's awesome. Mm. With your Chef's Kitchen, I'm Allison Walker. If you'd like to make the Grateful Loafer for dinner tonight, you can print out the complete recipe on our website, cfnews13.com slash chef's kitchen.